Mummy, where did you put the kitchen roll? Right, I know, I know I had some kitchen roll, but I don't know where it is. Mother has put it away. It's all right though, mate. It was only really to soak up the oil from the samosas, but let's just put some oily samosas in our mouths. Who cares? Let's hope the samosas are better than your accents. After deep frying, they're ready. Indian samosas and chicken pakoras with a nice slick of oil. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'll just put bubbles in his chair and I'll wash my hands. <laughs> No, I'm genuinely not. in a chair. He actually is. <laughs> Do you ever feed him at the table? Sometimes. Do you really? Well, it's not, apparently, it's not good for dogs to eat sitting up. They have to be like stirred on oh, their it's legs. It's not. It's not but really so good for some... dogs to eat yeah. at the table. At the table in a high chair. Come on, it's a blinking dog. I regularly buy samosas, oh. and I have to say that these are absolutely outstanding. Excellent. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh, that's such a nice compliment. Oh. I'd just like to thank the little people. Nice I'd like to thank crying. my mum, <laughs> my brother, um, for teaching me, for bringing me up to oh. be such an amazing human. <laughs> 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 for just giving you me... You can calm down now, Kate Winslet. ...giving me the strength yeah. to yeah. make yeah. this. Toby said that it was the best thing that he'd eaten ever, and I'm like, what? Where are you eating, mate? Blinking it, come on. I know she's a beautiful girl, but come on. I have had samosas before quite a few times, and uh, and that's definitely up there with the memorable ones. I, I don't eat loads and loads, so... Have you I... got a small stomach? Yeah, so, I mean, like, I can take it home with me. <laughs> yeah, I can make it home with mind. Yeah, of course, definitely. A doggy bag. If you want it, yeah, of course. The starter went down a tree. I'm really happy with it. Good reviews. Back at the table, Zyra's trying to work out what her guests do for a living. You are something to do with computers. I use a computer, oh. <laughs> but I don't do anything in the computing world, though, no. Um. Um, no, I, I use computers to write. So you're an author? I'm an author. I what? So what? Are you published? I am published. What, what do you write about? I write fantasy. You know, Lord of the Rings kind of Middle magic. Yeah. Middle yeah. Earth, yeah, goblins. magic and, yeah, some goblins, uh, that kind of thing, mm. you know. I'm sure there'll be a lot of people out there who'd like to read it from the age of 12 to 16, but, no, nah, not for me, but thanks anyway. I think that you might actually be a lady that's been able to stay at home with the kids. All my kids are grown up now. My turn now. Yeah. But you're nearly there. You work in an office. Yeah, that's really close, isn't it, to being <laughs> looking after kids. That's what a stupid thing to I wasn't say. trying to get that. <laughs> I was Jesus. trying to get something random. I'm retired, so I suppose I'm a lady of leisure. I reckon that you are an artist of sorts. Oh, uh, you could say. I'm actually a support worker, but I also work for the radio in Basingstoke. Wow. Yeah. Zara's personality is fantastic. The way she comes across, she's bubbly, lively. She couldn't be more energetic if she tried. I could see you easily on a children's really? programme. Have already got a name for it, sorry. Because you're so Heather. fun, you're, you're bubbly and you oh. don't shut up and... <laughs> kids love that, don't they? <laughs> they do, that's, that's why I can see you doing it. You'd yeah. be great at it. <gasps> she said I was loud. And I thought, you don't say that to someone when you first meet them. She was probably saying it in a nice way and then hoping that I'll take it in and stop being a little bit more quiet. But it's not going to happen. It's only going to happen when I don't want them to hear me what I'm talking about. And breathe. When she comes to my dinner party, she will not be sat next to me. My ears been aching all night. For goodness sake, shut up.